six in the morning. Uh, I've just decided to uh, have a wander down to a new place down in the town. Uh, low tide's at 6.38. I've got about a half hour walk to get there when it should just about be becoming light. There's a couple of boats, them lights you can see, a couple of boats going out fishing. So there's a few people about, but not many. Right, I'll be back when I get there. It's, uh, I've got a nice little walk ahead of me. Well, I had hoped to do in front of those rocks. But obviously the tide has not gone out far enough. There's still 20 minutes till low tide, so I'll um, hang around on this bit of beach here and see if it goes out. If not, my plans are scuppered. Oh, anyway. Well, my plans have been scuppered. Um, directly in front of you, where the water bows round, there's some, a load of black rocks. And I had wanted to go down in front of those when the tide went out. Well, it was low tide at 6.38. It's now 6.57 and it hasn't gone out far enough, so I'm not going to have another opportunity to get down here, so unfortunately that's me beat, which is a real shame because I really wanted to do that. So I'm going to head back up the beach, see what else we can find, see if we can find some older stuff where we normally go. Right, just had the first find, looks to be a penny. Uh, I'm just hunting as I've been hunting the last few days, so back to the next one. Right, well I had the penny there, and I've just had a little target there which I've dug up, and it's a really small coin, uh, with some sort of pattern on it, I can't make out what that is at all, um, it might be a little locket thing, because it's got a spike on it, so I don't know, it might be some sort of bracelet, or I'll have to clean that up better when we get it. have a look. Right, I'm going to spiral out from here. Because obviously having two targets like that in one area means there might be some good stuff here. Back soon. Right, we just had uh, some sort of buckle type thing. Uh, it's got some writing on the back. I can't see what that says. Okay, and uh, that's just down there. I've got another target. There. So let's dig that. Well, that other hole wasn't anything, but I just run my coil over there and lay it on top there. There's another penny, pretty badly corroded. So we're still finding coins, albeit not the old stuff at the moment. Well, apart from that other coin, we don't know what it is. But I'll come back round to the four posts again. Um, yeah, funny thing with four posts running through my videos. As I seem to do better here, um, so we'll carry on round so we can Right, I don't know if you can see that down there. Another coin on the surface. Just laying. No, it's not a coin. That's a dog tag. I can see that through the. Uh, oh, I think it's a dog tag. Uh, I think that's a dog tag. I don't know. Let me, brush, let me brush it up a bit. Hang on a minute. The honest answer is, I don't know on that one. I can't see any detail on it. Uh, all I'm going to have to do is get that in my acid bath and I'll get back and uh, see what it is. So, right, carry on. There we go. A dog's footprint. And he's knocked a coin out. Two P piece. So we're doing alright. Not the older stuff today, more modern stuff, but that's okay. Still coins. When I was heading for the rocks, I didn't take my sand scoop, I took my shovel. Uh, and obviously uh, that didn't work out. Now, I didn't even see sitting on the uh, scoop there. I've got a coin. I haven't looked at it yet. That is a modern 10 pence piece. Came out the hole there, probably about three, four inches down. Definitely seen better days, but uh, we're still going. It's a nice morning and we're still finding, so can't ask so much more really. Right, on we go. Right, just had the next coin, just run out the hole. Oh, 
modern, another modern penny. I'll get that in the sun, you see a bit of detail. So, we'll spiral out from here and uh, see what we can get. Right, come out for a quick afternoon spin or late evening. That's the bit of beach I normally do down there. Um, but on the other side of that jetty this time, as you can see, quite a vast expanse of beach right down to the cliff down there. Uh, been here about 10 minutes so far, haven't found anything, but we'll keep hunting and we may be back with some finds. Right, I'm going to see that now. Modern 5p piece just come out, hole there. So we seem to be finding in this little cove, so hopefully we'll rack up on some more. Right, we'll carry just our second 5p out the same spill, so I'll check it again, see if there's any more there. Right, just had next find, another 5p. Seems to be sort of the 5p hunt today. Right, we'll spiral out, see if there's any more. I think this detector must be set on 5p mode this evening. That's all it's finding. Well, it's been a good evening hunt. Here's a quick panorama where I actually am. As you can see, it's getting dark. Cars have got their headlights on there. And uh, there's the beach. Tide's out. Um, it's exposed all these rocks here. But yeah, it's just a nice evening. It's not that warm, but it's nice to be out. And uh, first evening hunt, I think I've done a video on, so hope you enjoyed it, it's been a bit of a 5p hunt, we mainly found 5p coins, um, but yeah, keep watching, there's more to come.